published, Hormones in Your Health, The Smart Woman's Guide to Hormonal and Alternative Therapies for Menopause. In the new book, you claim that contrary to current recommendations, HRT is safe for long-term use and highly beneficial as long as you do it right. Tell us why you think hormones are so great. Because combined with a healthy lifestyle, they actually do protect, if they're properly prescribed and properly taken, every body system that has ever been studied. Women's bodies are designed to function while we live and are vibrant with estrogen and progesterone in a sequential process. Why are many doctors still so wary of hormones? Certain breast cancers and certain hormones go together. Certain hormonal regimens seem to reduce that risk. The Women's Health Initiative was a major study that shook up the whole world because its data, which were very interesting and very valuable, were not interpreted correctly. They were misunderstood. And in that group, that regimen caused an extra eight cases of breast cancer for every 10,000 women. That was real. It was very tiny. It was under one half of 1%. But it was so contrary to what was perceived at the time that it shook up the medical establishment. It, in retrospect and from hindsight, we've learned a great deal about that study and that regimen and other studies and other regimens, all of which combine to convince me that appropriately dosed hormonal regimens are marvelous for women. So I disagree with the current recommendation of hormone therapy for as low a dose as possible for as short a time as possible, because it's very clear from the literature that has been published that women who use hormones for many years and use them appropriately live longer than women who do not use hormones, and they live better. 25 women for every 100,000 die of breast cancer. Eight times as many die of cardiovascular disease. So the real monster in the closet for women to be aware of when they're healthy and they're in their 40s and their early 50s is cardiovascular disease. Why is your book essential reading for women over 35? Physicians are caught in a terrible time bind. I don't see patients. I get to study. So I'm excited to be able to offer women and their physicians a state-of-the-art, understandable translation. They can work with their physician and have a good regimen to help them live well and long. So is it true that you are 65 years old? No, I'm not 65. I'm 64 and a half. Na, 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 na.